Yeah, so we are kind of in a um, pre-emergency status um, right now. It's been announced. Many schools and businesses have had to close or change their hours because of the severe weather hitting Central Texas this week. It's leaving many to wonder what that means for city services like water and trash pickup. Tonight we're looking at another solid week of Arctic cold snow and freezing rain until probably next Thursday or Friday. 25 News reporter Joe Lopez starts us off. Todd, Naya, the bad news is it's cold outside and it's only going to get colder. But the good news is that city service crews are doing whatever they can to make sure that the city stays operational in this weather. The rainy weather freezing nearly everything in sight. You know, when you're operating heavy machinery like this, we're used to doing it in hot weather, not freezing cold weather. Crews were out collecting garbage yesterday and will be out again tomorrow. If you see a trash truck driver stop by your house, give them a wave. You know, they're out there busting their butts trying to service your, your, your area. But as conditions deteriorate, Solid Waste decided to close Monday and Tuesday, pushing Monday collection to Wednesday and Tuesdays to Saturday. We just want to make sure everyone stays safe and the roads are clear and, and um, you know, the trucks have a hard time operating when it's five degrees outside. For Waco City Services like the Water Department, they're doing their best to keep things flowing. Yeah, so it's always hard um, because, of course, it's very, very cold outside, but we still have to get down and sometimes get in the water and, um, you know, fix leaks as they happen. Jonathan Eccles with the Waco Water Utility Service says cold snaps can cause pipes to burst, power to go out, but Waco Water is geared up with generators and reserve water so families don't run dry. We're prepared. We have things on standby and um, crews ready to shift into action. Um, and to platoon and go, you know, 12 hours on, 12 hours off, that kind of thing. The big takeaway from this is just to be patient. As you heard, crews are working very hard to keep the city operational in the cold weather. Reporting in Waco, Joel Lopez, 25 News.